exactly why we need your help, boss. Maybe if we could get these documents, we could find the answers you seek. Are you and mom getting a divorce? Yes, because the other day I saw mom crying after you left for work. Jimmy and I played golf a few days before his death. There's somebody out there taking out the members of Letter or one after the other. If you don't help us to catch this lunatic anytime soon, who knows who the next victim might be? I'm sorry for keeping you people waiting. I was on a conference call with our partners. I summoned you here because of a new development. I'm sure you've been listening to the news recently and you heard about the death of three people who are key to this company. Our legal counsel for the last 20 years and then two major shareholders of Nectar Oil. Initially, I thought it was just life happening until two agents of the Criminal Investigation Unit paid me a visit. They are the ones investigating the case. And they said it is murder. Murder? Yes, they said it's murder. That the killer is on a possible revenge mission. Now, I don't know who the killer is or why he or she is on a revenge mission on Nectar Oil. Did they tell you they have a proper lead? I don't think they have any proper lead yet. They just have some puzzles that they're trying to piece together uh, to be able to make a proper case. So we must find out what it is they're looking for and get rid of it so that it doesn't put this company in any jeopardy. That means we need to act very fast, sir. We really need to act fast. And by the way, they requested for the legal files of this company for the last 20 years. They believe that whatever the killer is killing for will be found in those files. Did you give them the files? Certainly not. But I can't hold out for much longer. If they go through the Attorney General, I'll have no choice but to deliver those files to them. But, sir, I thought we had the Attorney General on our payroll. That was before. The present Attorney General, well, they say he's a Christian, or so he claims. So it's been a difficult nut to crack. When Coyote was there, it was easier for us to deal with legal matters. But since he resigned, this new one has not been easy to get across to. Very true, sir. Coyote was a very loyal servant to you. 
Yes, he was because I made him who he was. From a small town lawyer to becoming the chief judge. And then from there to becoming the attorney general. So it was easy for us to get certain things done. Hmm. I can assure you, we're going to find out what the problem is. And I suggest we act quickly and get to work and don't waste time. Yes, we need to act fast. Because something tells me that these two agents will be back. So we must search those files and get rid of anything that is incriminating that might put us in any kind of trouble. Philip is in charge. Whatever you need, just get in touch with him. Philip, I need proper heads up on this investigation. Most definitely, sir. All right. I'll see you again. All right, guys, you've heard the boss. So, I'm going to create a link and forward it to each one of you. Now, with that link, you can connect to the company's server. And you have access to everything from day one till now. Now, I need you all not to forget this because it is very important that what you're doing is strictly confidential. I'll be back to see how the work is going. Hello? Hello, Mr. Shaka Badman. This is Miss Kuku, the head of the CIU Lagos. Oh, madam. Uh, good day. Your men were here yesterday. Well, that's the reason why I'm calling right now. I want to know how the meeting went. All right, I'm all ears. My men had told me that they have made a request concerning a certain document that would aid our investigation. Yes, they did. So when are we going to get them? You see, madam, the problem is that these documents are not just ordinary documents that you can just hand over to anybody. Uh, Mr. Shagun Badmo, sorry to cut you. You have a document that will aid this investigation. And as far as you are a citizen under the laws of Nigeria, whatever the law wants, the law must get. I understand perfectly, madam. I'm still consulting with my partners. As soon as I am done, I'll get back to you. Well, I am giving you a 24 hours window. If I don't get those documents, I would have the attorney call you. Personally, by himself. It doesn't have to get to that, madam. Please. Oh, Mr. Shagun Batmos, when I took this job, I made an oath to this office. And I have made a promise that I would do everything within my power to close all my cases. My advice for you this morning is to give me every document with you. You have an answer to our questions, a possible answer to our questions. If you don't give me those documents, I would make sure that the court sanctions you. If you have nothing to hide, Mr. Badmus, then you must get yourself out of this mess and give us those documents. I understand perfectly. This is the last time I'm going to be calling you. Goodbye. Philip. What's happening with you guys? Where is this update? The CIU is on us already. I need those updates, please. All right, I'm waiting.
What? I won. Dad, what are you doing here? <laughs> well, you wouldn't see me, so what was I supposed to do? Dad, but I told you I'll make our time to come see you. And I told you it was urgent. Dad, how urgent can it be that you can't wait for me to make our time to come to the I house? I've waited for five years for you to come. Okay, um, Simon, I think you should hear him out, but um, I'm going to be over there. Nice to meet you, sir. Yes, thank you. Mm, so I... I finally get to meet uh, Rebecca. <laughs> Beautiful young woman. <laughs> okay, Dad, you're here now, please. Say what you have to say so I can get back to work. Well, uh, <clears throat> the last time I saw you was um, at your mom's remembrance, which I believe was uh, five years ago. And, uh, and I remember you telling me that you didn't want to set eyes on me again and that you weren't going to attend the funeral and... <sighs> Dad, why would I want to? I mean, I could be anywhere in the world and mom, mom, but not with you, not with the person who let her die. Things are complicated, Simon. How complicated can they be? You need to allow me to, to explain to you. And I want to explain to you, but you are not giving me a chance. Okay. Okay, Dad. You're here. Please speak. I, I can't tell you that here. Yeah, I mean, you need to come to the house, Simon. What do you mean you can't tell me here, Dad? Two seconds ago, you just told me you wanted to talk to me. Now you don't want to talk to me anymore? You're always confused, Dad. You're always confused. You're so confused that you had a good family in your hands and you let them slip out. You're always confused. You let them die. S -s Stop it, Simon. <sighs> Dad, you want to know the truth? You want to actually know what I think? <sighs> 